This will actually help me watch this stuff. So, are you being, uh, discriminated? Yes, we're being treated, we're being treated like second class see us as a threat, I think, but they, you know, at the local level, they should see us as an asset because we're helping out with local level, helping liberty-minded candidates, and, you know, you know I, I, I think, you know, ultimately, we're going to succeed, that our, our ideas of liberty will succeed. It's just a matter of when. Did Ron Paul specifically ask you guys to do this in there, to do this? No, he didn't ask. He didn't no. have nothing to do with it. He, no. You know, he thinks people are all individuals and should, should act of their own accord and do what they think is right, right. and that's what we did in there. We thought, we wanted to give... We wanted an up or down vote to get our duly elected delegates seated. We wanted an up or down vote, and that's what we wanted. We did, we did it. We thought it was right. There were over 2,000 Republicans at the main state convention that elected us. We, we won by margins of victory over 100 votes. They were claiming there were illegal votes cast, and, they, and the people who were contesting us didn't even prove that there was one illegal vote cast. Yet we were winning by over 100 votes. So it's just somebody didn't endorse this. What's that? He did not. He no, he didn't know what he was going to do. He didn't know what he was going to do. Oh, wow. Okay. Right, thank you. Thank you. Your name? It's uh, Brent Tweed. 